For the University of Chicago, this is not something that is additional. It is not something that is at the margin. Uh, we are a place that is devoted to inquiry at the highest level, and that means that all perspectives need to be present, need to be at the table. Our commitment to our business relationships, you know, needs to be reflective of the community in which we serve. We have leadership from both the University and the Medical Center Human Resources team that are looking at firms that will help with employee development, leadership development, and employee engagement. We have firms from ad agencies to public relations firms that are here to help offer some business solutions that may be applicable to us now and in the future as we grow. We know all the wealth is being created in professional services and in financial services. That's where the growth in our economy is, and it's only fair for us to be included. And Nadia got that and uh, the University of Chicago gets it. And it's just so unbelievably rare to see that. Our relationships aren't built overnight. So we participated in the forum and the symposium last year. We're participating again this year. And I think I can clearly see that over that period of time, we have a closer or a better relationship with the folks that we met last year. And as well, we're meeting others that are involved with the University of Chicago. So I am the one who's sitting at the table there, nudging them and asking them, what are you doing? What, are you, what kind of responsibility do you have? Because um, it's important as they grow their businesses that they understand that diversity is key to that growth. And in my opinion, investment in human capital is the best investment that we can make. And you know what I think what's interesting about what's happening now in this world, it is no longer business as usual. We already saw that what we thought was working is no longer working. And so I think the point of that is with all these reforms in place, with all these new rules in place, we have no choice but to do things differently both personally and professionally, and that includes how we do our business. And out of that would grow not just talk and not just a nice reception, which I hope you're enjoying, but actual action, meaning that deals are done uh, and people are hired. We brought on a money management firm, uh, Williams Capital Management. We also brought on two minority IT firms and um, an executive search firm. We had an opportunity to work with the uh, medical center, the executive team. Uh, we took them on a two-day retreat, um, and during that time we spent uh, uh, time just kind of aligning the vision for the organization and uh, spent time putting together specific initiatives that uh, the organization is going to take forward going, going forward. Uh, we had a roundtable panel that um, we wrote about within the magazine, and then we did the roundtable discussion here on the campus and partnered with with MSNBC as well. So Tamron Hall came in and we had terrific people speaking and representatives from UFC, but it really was a real partnership. So we are seeing some results from this, this type of forum and I'm just hoping that we can continue to, to build on that. Uh, so it's been a great exposure to some firms that have done uh, work uh, that is very relevant to what we do at the University of Chicago. And I think that's really what we have to keep in mind that Great institutions like the University of Chicago uh, can help spawn and build new businesses through their purchasing power. And so the type of forum that the University of Chicago has put together allows us to meet with the key decision makers, which in many cases we may not ever have had an opportunity to do. And I think a symposium, and this is the second year of the symposium, it's a wonderful thing and it's getting better. So it's going to create more economic opportunities for our university and for our community.